Good evening, everybody. This is Brooklyn Sound coming to you straight from the top of my Leo Palace apartment, as always, on this Sunday night. And at first, I wasn't going to make a video, but I haven't made one in a while. I was supposed to make. I was supposed to make one. I was supposed to have made one last week, but um, I forgot what happened. I think I fell asleep. So here is my update for the past two weeks. So far, I have finished almost all of my lessons for each of the junior high school students. I finished lessons for the first and everyone but one class of um, one class in the among the third year students. So I have my last class with the third year students on Tuesday, and on Monday I finish teaching most of the second year students and it was it was a little sad there weren't any tears or anything like that I got a lot of letters from the third year students which were nice to read through I think I got maybe 160 of them because there are about 40 students in each class and I teach about four classes with one of my JTEs so about 160 letters and this week, last week was pretty slow. The kids had tests on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So on those three days, I was mainly studying Japanese and catching up on whatever else I needed to, mostly lessons. And on Friday, my Kyoto sensei or my vice principal had asked me to say a speech for tomorrow on Monday at this uh, ceremony that one of the JTs has planned for me. So I quickly wrote something up. I thought long and hard about it because I wasn't exactly sure how long the letter should be. But after writing a full page of words that I thought would be encouraging for the students, I showed the letter to one of the other JTEs. I have six, so I have many people to show um, lesson plans and ideas to. So after writing my letter, I showed my letter to uh, one of the JTEs and she suggested that instead of having a full page, I should take up at least 60 to 75 percent of the um, of a page so that was my ballpark mark so I went back to my desk and I thought to myself okay what can I take out to not have the letter completely I guess misunderstood because if I took out too much then certain parts of the message certain parts of the letter wouldn't seem right it would need the entire page for um um, everything to make sense. So I took out the parts that were um, unnecessary and I got to maybe about 60% of the page and I just kept it at that part. I showed it to another JTE, the one who will be on stage uh, translating everything as I say it and I guess he thought it was okay. He made a photocopy of it and I think I'm ready for tomorrow. And I'll be wearing a suit. I'm going to wear my black suit. I thought about wearing the shark skin one, but I thought to myself, I showed up to the school wearing my black suit, so I'm going to end with my black suit. Yes. And I finished up on Tuesday. So after that, I will have more time to catch up on anime. My current anime right now is Dragon Ball Super. It's been out for a while, so I'm catching up on that. Along with One Piece. I'm very behind in One Piece. I'm on episode maybe 320-something. <laughs> and I'm trying to catch up before it gets to the 1,000th episode. Which, I don't even know when. I know the anime is on 900 and... 900 and something, but I think I'll have enough time, especially in March since I'm not working for more than half of the month, so we'll see what happens. And in the meantime, I'm just finalizing 
um, paperwork for this new apartment that I found in Osaka. So once things are finished there, I should be able to move on in by the end of the month. And I will have a lot more time to reflect on this six month journey that I've been on so far. I still don't know where I'm going to be working in at in April. I don't know what school. I don't know whether or not I'll be sticking with junior high school, elementary, or high school. So until then, I don't know. You don't know. We don't know. So I'll let you know as soon as I know. Peace.